y'all living right now? Under the bridge at 35 and airport. Basically, I believe we were targeted as a homeless hate crime. Um, uh, this isn't the first time, but it actually caught fire yesterday. Um, it became pretty severe and it even burnt up uh, areas across the street. As you see over there, the fire spread um, because of the fact that the, it, the wind was blowing. Luckily, we had another tent kind of put up to where we were able to salvage that. It was a disappointment to see uh, individuals around you that are uh, attacking me in that way. The people have been driving by, throwing things, shooting at us um, over the past couple months. We've been going through this, you know, the whole time we've been homeless, but yet at the same time, this is becoming more serious. Um, I feel like it's a hate crime towards homelessness because there's been so many people that have driven by and screaming out words and stuff like that. One of our biggest concerns and problems is, is uh, APD or other uh, enforcement figures that it's like, well, you've chosen to live in an area in which you substantially have no rights. And it's like, why? You know, why, why don't we have the same rights? Wherever you go, you're still ultimately trespassing on someone's land, even if it's government property. Do we want to stay here? Do we want the trouble, you know? But then where do you go? Um, housing lists and resource lists are so backed up, you know, at times. We're still waiting on all that. It's always been the same. It just uh, gets more frustrating, you know, as it goes along and people aren't uh, really respecting you as a human being like themselves. Encourage the homeless people around you, feed them and love them because at any given time, you're just a paycheck away from being homeless yourself.